There's people outside my base. Past me hates me. She just left me here to deal with these pillagers. <laughs> and there's a skeleton in a tree. <laughs> I just want to record my intro. Okay, let's go deal with my problems before I forget. Wait, did they just disappear? <laughs> oh, I think they just despawned. Never mind. I can't ignore my problems. Hello all and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Junk Drawer. If you are new to the series, Minecraft Junk Drawer is basically just a normal survival series, except if I build something once, I cannot build it again for the rest of the series. Last time we built this cool storage room with this kind of statue bust looking thing on top of it. So if I make anything like this again, I'm not supposed to, because those are the rules. I don't make the rules, I just make the series. Actually, I also made the rules. There's another skeleton! Why aren't you burning? I'm gonna ignore him for now. Also, guess who's feeling thoroughly uninspired? Me. I'm running out of things to do while I'm ignoring the nether. Ow. Burn, 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 burn. Yeah, best way to deal with mobs. I do have a couple of ideas of what I want to do this episode. I mentioned last time that I wanted to make a fishing dock, but as I was thinking about said idea, I thoroughly overcomplicated the idea to the point where it is now part of my mega base. Not that one, different one. So I can't quite make that yet. In the meantime, there's one more thing that I really want to get done. Where is it? It's over here. That is to give these guys a proper home because my mega base idea requires a heck of a lot of copper. Oh, there's honey dripping on me. So I need honeycomb. Right now, I don't have very much copper, like, at all. So I think we're gonna have to go copper mining today. Obviously, we're not gonna get all of it right away. Hello, hippo. I may be able to call you by your full name someday, but for now, you're just hippo. Disestablishmentarianism, that's manageable enough. You, you don't need a nickname, but hippo, hippo is hippo for now. I haven't tested it at all. I just know that I want a good majority of this build to be made out of copper. So I'm gonna have to go check through some caves with my fortune pickaxe and try to glean as much from the walls and such as I can. Oh! There's the rest of you. But before all that, I need to figure out how to make a bee farm. I've looked up a couple tutorials and one in particular was very helpful. I will try to link it in the description. Very simple, very well explained, very well illustrated. And the dude just has a really fun accent to listen to. So that made it a lot easier to follow along. I do have a couple of bees nests, but I'm not sure if they actually have bees in them. Oh, also I need to make a silk touch pickaxe. <laughs> uh, I'm so behind on everything. Should I wait until I can get other enchantments on this? Maybe I should. Mm. Fine. Maybe I'll go get some levels first then. Four did it! I did it! That's enough. Grab some rotten flesh and let's get out of here. And down my favorite way. These vines are getting long. Wee! <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I deserve that. <laughs> that hasn't happened in a while, though. I think the first thing I'm gonna do is question whether or not this has bees in it, because I haven't seen my bees in a while. The second thing I'm gonna do is encase this tree in glass and maybe try to put a couple more beehives down and see if I can get some more bees. I was worried for a second. I thought I didn't have enough flowers. Then I remembered I have a surplus over at my iron farm. Oh yeah, we're fine. Doink, doink. I think I will put Silk Touch on my pickaxe. Ooh, hopefully this will be enough. Okay. Do I have enough for mending? I do, I have just enough. All right, perfect. I cannot lose this now. Silk Touch will be very handy because we're gonna be dealing with glass and with beehives. So let's see how this goes. It's not gonna look pretty. It's not supposed to. I'm saying this mostly for my benefit so that I don't overthink it as much. This is not a permanent solution. Super temporary bee box acquired. Let's see if either of these have any bees in them. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. There are bees. Okay, great. No, don't come out. Don't come out, please. Okay, here, stay here. I got, I've got flowers for you now. I'm sorry. I'm gonna make a campfire real fast. So I need to collect the bees. Hi! We need to collect the bees at night, I believe, because that's when they are all in their hives. But I'm not sure if we have, I think we need at least three in each of these. Hi, that's for you. Where's your friend? There were like six of you a minute ago. Where are the rest? There we go. Okay, okay, there's a few of you now. Make more. There's a baby bee. Look at them. Hi. Okay, I should put some bushes around that campfire so you don't accidentally kill yourself on that. Okay, I'm about to-
about to try something. Please don't get mad at me. Okay, here we go. Nice, got honeycomb. As cute as this is already, it's still a box. So I'm gonna make a more automatic farm for them. Hi, you're adorable. Yay, baby bee. It's a baby. Oh, you little escape artist. A teeny tiny baby bee just flew through this one little crack. Hey, wait, dude, come back. Come back. Come on, come on. Come on, baby. Come on. I think all the hives might be full because he's not finding a place to... Never mind, there he goes. I need to stop feeling bad for the babies. They're obviously so much smarter than I am. Look at them all so happy. There's so many baby bees. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna go do a bit of copper mining real fast. Hold up, why am I doing this so casually? I'm going into a cave with moms and death and I have nearly lost my stuff multiple times down here. I should probably be freaking out a lot more than I am. Oh, there's you. There's a you. Oh, shoot. I could make you be nice to me, but I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm just gonna get rid of you because you apparently are magic and can shoot behind you. Sorry, dude. I forgot I'd have a boat down here. <laughs> I think that's been there since like day one. Oh, there's also a bed down here. Wow, okay. I obviously left in a very big hurry last time. Ooh, copper. Oh, lava. Oh, gosh. Whoosh. Okay, I forgot how big this cave was. You know what? Well, it's, yeah, just in case. This shader pack in particular is making it very difficult to discern diamonds and glow lichen. I'm really hoping I lit this place up enough that I won't be attacked quite as frequently as I used to be whenever I came down here. Nope, I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon, but I heard it that time. Where is he? Of course he's right behind me. This is where I died a lot last time. Oh, but there's a good little patch of copper there. Oop, shoot, oop, shoot, oop, shoot, oop, shoot, oop, shoot, oop, shoot. Okay, we trained for this though. light it up like there's no tomorrow because there may not be one if I stay down here. Hey look, coal. You should always take coal because sometimes there won't be coal and that is the worst feeling when you run out of coal. This was a really nice cave for my first couple of days though because there's so much iron here. Wonder if I can grab this. Never mind, I'm down here now. There you go. Blow up your friend for me. Is he still alive? I don't think he is. Okay, cool. It feels kind of weird just ignoring all this iron, but I really, really don't need it for once. Copper, 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 copper. How are we doing? Oop, time to make some bean blocks. All right, we need way more than that. Now, obviously I'm not collecting all of the copper I need for this mega build-ish thing right away. I'm not that crazy. See, there's so much in the ceiling and I can't reach it. It's, this is gonna take me forever. There is so much copper that I need for this. So, so, so much. Ooh, that looks like death. These torches keep making me think that stuff is moving there. It's not. It's just my paranoia saying hi. Oh, never mind. That was a real thing. Hi. Oh, that's right. I have knocked back. This is going to take a while. Never mind. It didn't take that long. Oh, there's a few of you over here. Is there a spawner or is it just dark? Yep. I, I feel you. I feel you. I know you're there. Oh, there's a baby. That's why. <laughs> Eat the child. Okay, cool. I'm running out of torches all the live long day. I am running out of extra patience cause the skeletons are in my way. There's a really freaky spider trying to climb on my head. Where'd you go? Where'd it go? <laughs> Can't you hear the player screaming? I will kill you dead. Why are you stuck there? Here, have some light. And also have some sword. Because you're making me nervous. Deeps like copper. Pretty. Oh, time to make some more bean blocks. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. What's hitting me? It's a skeleton. Of course it is. It always is. It's always you. I'm going to yeet you into this cavern. Yeet. Oh, ow. Great. Leave me alone for just a second. I need to... Oh, there's another one. Okay. Running, running. Tactical fleeing. Tactical fleeing so I can eat something. Ow, I'm in a hole. Ow, I'm in a hole of my own making. I've dug my own grave and now I shall die in it. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. He's right there. Taunting me. Hi. Hi. 
Hello. Hi. Right. Come here so I can make you die properly. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Shield's gone, shield's gone, shield's gone, shield's gone. There we go, okay. Now he's gone. All right, time to collect our last items and go. Because now I don't have a shield. Those diamonds. Oh no. And there's so much copper here too. Oh no. I'm gonna have a hard time leaving. And I'm out of torches. Okay, now's definitely a good time to go. Oh wait, actually, I can make more torches. Let me just grab a piece of iron. I'll smelt it and make another shield. Awesome, I got more materials. Let's go make more bad decisions. Water is not my friend. Hi? <laughs> Never mind, water's my friend. It saved my life. Water, you and I are now bonded for life. Okay, this copper is not worth it. I've decided. <laughs> Stuff sneak out up on me. That's not nice of it. Oh, I should definitely put my shield into my slot. Oh, I never crafted my shield. That was really smart of me. Okay, let's craft a shield. There we go. I think I genuinely have memory issues, guys. <laughs> this is, it keeps happening. I would love to think that I'm panicking less, but you know, it's just, it's, I think I might just be getting a little bit too comfortable with this. Oh, there is a, I was gonna say a wall of water, but I guess there's a word for that in a waterfall. This is a lot deeper than I thought it was. I think I'm in danger. What's up, dude? Well, it's probably just one, but we'll find out. Yeah, oh well. Oh, I do not have room for you in my inventory, how rude. Three, nice, okay. This is a bad idea. You killed the glow squid. That's supposed to be my job. Well, I guess I get glow ink today. I'm not panicked. I'm very confident in my decision to come down here and do things that really probably shouldn't be doing. I think that's a decent enough dismount. What's shooting me? Where are you? And I'm so sorry. Please don't kill me today. You know what? Maybe I'm safer down here. That kind of sort of scared me out of my skin. Take two? Take two. I think we're doing take two. Oh, there you are. Hello. Thank you for waiting for me. Follow the torches, follow the torches, follow the torches home. How did I get down here? I'm glad you I'm glad you all came up with me to, you know, share in this journey. This is great. Now I'm definitely not stuttering out of intense fear and panic and paranoia, but it's fine. I haven't done this in a while, you know? I think this is this was good. This was good for us. This was good for me. Very therapeutic. Also, I'm not picking up any of this. I continue to forget that granite exists and is actually kind of cool as a building block. That should be enough. Time to go home, 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 time to go home. Ooh, look, copper. Time to go home, time to go home, time to go home, time to go home, time to go home. My bridge looks really cool from underneath. Time to go home, time to go home. Okay, we're home. That was relatively painless, almost, kind of. We didn't die though, that's great. We got some diamonds out of it. Time to start smelting all of this copper. And I might swap one of these out for my super smelter, so let me go grab that real fast. I just keep pulling things out of this, out of my old house, and I feel bad for it. But I, I just, I don't really need it anymore. And it feels weird knowing that. It's too late, it's already done. Say hello. hello. <laughs> Say hello to Hippo. Hi. You wanna see my makeshift bee farm? Oh, it's in a tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh shoot, oh shoot, I forgot that one didn't have a campfire under it. You be angry in there. <laughs> Hello, I'm sorry. Here, have some flowers. Oh, you're still mad at me. I'm sorry. You know what? Never mind. Here, just... I'll, I can take it. Everybody gets flowers. <laughs> oh my gosh, all of the babies have grown up. There's so many of you now. Yeah, it is. Wait, no, 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 don't go outside. There's just a... Mm. I have a paramonstrosis quipidaliophobia. Come here. Thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't let you outside, otherwise you'll die. Have you seen how many times I die? Yeah, good, stay there, thank you. Transition to time lapse.
it's nighttime. I need to go get the bees because I think everything else is pretty much in place. Also, I think the time lapse broke. Hello, friends. Are you going to bed? Are we all going to bed? You should all be in bed. Go back to where you were. Oh wait, are all of these the overflow? Oh, so none of none of you have homes. Is that why? I will make you some new homes later, but for now I need to steal the ones that we have. We got five. Yep, we got five. Okay, let's go stick them in while they're still asleep. So um, here's the bee farm so far. It's um a little bit cramped compared to what I was thinking it would be, but um, I'm just gonna go with it. Hopefully this won't wake them up. Okay, good. Oh, I also have not put any shears in these yet. Okay, that sounded promising. Sleep, 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 sleep. Hello, good morning. Oh, you can't get out. <laughs> I'm a genius. Okay, hold on. Um, I'm thinking now. I'm just now realizing what I've done. Don't think we can salvage this in the daytime. Okay, I definitely made this way too small, but I'm gonna work with it now to see if how angry all of you are gonna be because I um, boxed you in. This probably won't work. free. That's not good. Get back in. Come on. Come on. Oh, sure that works. Go back into the box. Go back in. No. I think I'm just gonna have to wait until nighttime again. <laughs> Here we go. Hopefully they are asleep now. Oh, hi. You are very much free. Oh, well. Now, hopefully I can just get rid of these. Oops. Sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. There we go. There we go. They're free. One of them is. Are the others okay? Well, I think that may or may not be an actual functioning bee farm, but we'll find out. Oh my gosh, they all came out at once. <laughs> Hi. Um, I think they're okay. I was just coming in to decorate a little bit. Let's see. Yay, it's working. Well, I will leave them to it. So, there's a build now. Here it is. Well, there's the back of it anyway. I don't know. I think it's cute. Do I have a boat? I do have a boat. Okay, good. Because that's kind of the only way you can properly see the front is by boat. Here's the back of the build. And here is the front of the build. It's a little coffee shop. A little seaside coffee shop. And the whole thing just looks like it could fall apart at any moment. I'm finding out that that's kind of my uh, build style. If it looks like it could give you tetanus, then we're good. I'm done. As well as looking like a very sketchy looking coffee shop. It's also a fully functional bee farm. Fully functional in the sense that it works. Um, not really in the sense that I can get to it. <laughs> you just can't go in through any of the doors. I can't get to the chest though. I made sure of that, but it is working very well. Case in point. Yeah, we've already got three and a half stacks. It's been running for a couple of hours, so that's pretty promising. Good job, guys. I wanted to show you how much it had produced, um, but I actually need a couple of these because I have a couple of copper chairs over here. So this is gonna be my first time waxing something, like at all. All right, here we go. So I wanna keep it in this state because it looks all rusty and cool. There we go. Oh, should we get the wax off achievement? Yeah, sure, why not? We got enough, honey. Hold on, let me go grab another one. There we go, wax off, and wax back on. I kind of wish I had made the build a bit bigger, and I definitely could expand it, but that would take a lot of time and effort, and I don't want to break the farm again. Also, I need a name for this little coffee shop. I might have a couple of ideas, but I think it would be fun for you guys to name it in the comments section below. So, if you think about it, I would love to have your help coming up with a name for our little our little honey farm coffee shop here. I'm pretty happy with how it turned out, actually. It's kind of small, but I like I really like the design. Like I said, as long as it's big enough for me, that's pretty much all I need. I will go bigger someday. And someday might be sooner than I think, because I'm, I'll just show you. I'm gonna do a big old mega base over here and connect some of those docks and make a whole bridge system around it. But for the main build itself, this is this is some some of the copper. Some of the copper. <laughs> Hold on, I, I need to get up higher. I need you all to see how much copper is here. Yeah, just a little, a little bit of copper. It goes behind the storage room too, by the way. This is about almost two stacks of copper blocks. I don't even know how much I need. I just know that this isn't 
nearly enough. This is probably good for like, not even the first part of the build. Uh, yeah, so looking forward to that, but I think I wanna build it over here. We'll see how big it actually gets. It doesn't take too much for something to be mega to me. Something to look forward to. We'll, we'll see how far we get. But that's gonna be it for today, everybody. Thank you all so much for watching. Again, go ahead and leave any name suggestions for a coffee shop down in the comments below. And if you have any questions, concerns, cries of shock, it's raining. Great, go ahead and leave those in the comments below as well. If this is your first time seeing one of my videos, hello and welcome to the chaos. And if this is not your first time, please consider subscribing. I just recently did a collab with Lucky Lane, Winter Windigo, and Empress Little Bit. We did Telepictionary, so if you wanna see that video, I will either link it in the description or it'll already be popping up at the end of the video, depending on when you're watching this. There's also a behind the scenes video linked in the description of my main episode. So if you wanna see behind the chaos, we get up to some fun shenanigans. Next episode, I probably will try to start on the mega base, question mark, hopefully, we'll see. Oh, that squid's dying. That's nice, that's fun to watch. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode of Minecraft Junk Drawer. Goodbye, all. Goodbye. Bye-bye.